This evening, uh, this morning at approximately 11.30 a.m., Correctional Administrator Deborah Johnson was found in her residence, deceased at the West Tennessee State Penitentiary. There was indication in her residence that foul play was involved. Immediately following, the facility was locked down and the official inmate count was conducted. At that time, inmate Curtis Ray Watson, 364744, was found missing from a work detail. Appropriate protocols was initiated. The TBI was contacted along with local law enforcement and a manhunt was initiated immediately. Deborah Johnson began her career with the Department of Corrections on January 30, 1981 as a correctional officer. She led a distinguished career over 38 years of service to the people of this great state. Ms. Johnson served in numerous positions in the Department of Corrections across the state, including correctional sergeant, deputy warden, warden, and most recently as a correctional administrator for the West Region. The inmate was a minimum custody offender assigned to a job of farm laborer at the Henning facility. Curtis Watson was serving a 15 year sentence on an especially aggravated kidnapping conviction out of Henry County, 2013. His current sentence was due to expire in 2025. Watson had previously been convicted of aggravated child abuse out of Carroll County. That sentence expired in 2011. He had no disciplinary duty in class. I want to extend my condolences to the family of Ms. Johnson, who was the victim of this homicide. Tonight, the TDOC is working closely with the TBI, the Department of Safety, and local law enforcement agencies to search and to find Curtis Ray Watson who is listed as the person of interest in this homicide. Rest assured that we will find this offender and bring justice to the family of Deborah Johnson.